So why are energy cubes so great? The reason why energy cubes are so good or basically why are they the best and basically feature of this mod is because they allow you to store energy and you can actually use this energy anywhere you want. For example, if I fill this energy cube up, what I can do is I can just break it and then what you can do is you can take it somewhere else and you can use that energy to, to power a machine. And this can be done like over a different dimension. So for example, um, I can use this in Nether or any other dimension that you may have installed, right? So let me actually show you how to use this, right? So basically as an example, I've plugged in some power energy source and basically what's doing is transferring the energy to the advanced cube. Now I'm gonna teach you something very, very quickly. I actually recommend going back to my mechanism tutorial because I explained this pretty well. I'm just gonna explain this very quickly. Come to the side configuration and as you can see what we get is we get sides. Make sure it's energy config. As you can see it says on the left, it says input. Make sure that whatever basically the cable is on, make sure it's input or output. It matters what you want to do. If you want to eject, also make sure that eject is on or off. Okay, so now we have a crusher. So this machine requires energy. What we can do is we can place an advanced energy cube or just about any cube. And as you can see it's actually not powered, right? So if I open this up, I try to put something Right, so as you can see, it's not working. I put a whole stack of cobblestone and it's not working, right? As you can see, there's no electricity on the right. This is an electricity bar, so it shows you if you have electricity or not. Okay, so what we need to do is we need to come here to the side configuration and we need to basically click to make sure it says output. As you can see, now it's working. Wow, amazing, right? So we can actually use this for any machine. But obviously some machines make may take more electricity than other ones. In this case, the crusher doesn't really take a lot of electricity, so it's absolutely fine and let's just leave it. Now, one more thing I want to show you is that the mechanism mode basically has tiers. So as you can see, we have basic energy cube, advanced, elite, ultimate, and creative. Apart from basically creative, everything else can be crafted. The creative, obviously, as the name suggests, is a creative energy cube, so this is only available in the creative mode. The higher the tier, the more expensive the cube or the crafting gets. However, the more, like, the higher the tier, the better the energy cube is, right? So in this case, as you can see, it only stores 1.6 million of the energy. However, the advanced water, the advanced energy cube stores 6.4. So that is a pretty big upgrade, right? The better the energy cube, the better the output. Now also, don't forget that the energy cube allows you to charge stuff. So if I put this here, as you can see, it's charging. So don't forget that you can actually charge stuff using the energy cubes. Also, you can decharge. Uh, unfortunately, I can't do this with this, but allows you to decharge as well, right? In this case, as you can see, I'm only allowed to charge. So very, very useful as well. One last thing I just want you to add is that you can actually chain all of these together, right? So as you can see, this one is the last one, which means this one's getting charged and you can actually join these up, right? So basically this energy cube is charging this and this energy cube is charging this one, right? So obviously if this one's full, then this one's gonna get full and then this one's gonna be the last one to get full. So you can chain or link all, the, all of these together. So if you want to build like a bank, um, there is another mod or basically another like a feature from mechanism that you can do and um, I'm not going to show you this it's called something called uh, energy matrix which is a bit more advanced and pretty costly but I'm going to show you that in the next episode or in the future episode right so that'll be it I hope you guys enjoyed if you can leave a like subscribe comment that'll be great as that'll help my channel grow and if you have any questions please comment down below I will try to answer as soon as possible and peace